Come this way. Oh, careful. Oh! Here we go. Come here, Dominic. I like how he sits down and you just plop down. What are you doing? <laughs> Yay! She dropped it. Get it. Throw it. Good job. Yeah. High five. All right. That one's too big for her, bud. The Yellow Springs Brewery announced it is expanding from seven barrels to a 15 barrel system. That will allow the brewery to produce five times the beer it now brews. The owner says customer response has been great. So we opened the brewery. Everybody, a uh, long time. Long time since I actually made a video myself. Well, a while. Um, I've been super busy. I, uh, have this hobby where I crochet. Yeah, here's what I'm working on now. I'm going to try and turn my phone around because I've been recording all of my videos on my phone. Um, so here's what I've been working on. Um, the color is lavender and it's a blanket. Um, the type of yarn I use is that. So you see how my kids are doing, well two to three, um, Peter is doing wonderful, um, he's really tall, um, he, well he's tall because I'm short, but he's also tall because his father, I'm not kidding, is like six foot something or whatever, but Peter will be nine, um, in November, and then there's little Miss Peyton, my wonderful daughter, I love her to death, um, just like I do. Peter and Dominic. Uh, Peyton lost her first two. She's six now. She, she's in first grade. And then there's little Dominic. He's 18 months. And of course, as you see, he's not being crushed. He just runs everywhere. He's wonderful. And I love him to that. Um, my kids are everything for me. To me. So he can see what we look like because I have my camera turned to face us so we can see each other or whatever. <laughs> We've been super busy this week, huh? With all the cleaning, organizing, getting ready for the fall. We've been playing games. Your Sissy loves Twister. She loves playing Twister. She likes card games. Yeah. Anything you want to tell them? No. You <laughs> just want to make faces. I love you. Dap, dap, dap. Ow, he's pinching me. See, I'm almost two. I'm almost two. Oh, apparently he's done. <laughs> Don't do it again. So turn around.
slide back a little bit. What? Why don't you get the football? Get the football. This way. Watch out for the football. Come on, baby. <laughs> Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Come on. I hope the camera's getting that. Camera. <laughs> yeah. Go get that, Dad. Hear me. All right, one last time. Ready? And then Mommy's gotta go figure out something for dinner. All right, go get Daddy. Come on. Ugh. I have nothing against anybody's religion or what they believe in and what they feel. But when the Pope, somebody from a totally different country, comes to my country and says, dude, you know, this is what I'm suggesting, and here's what I feel, and blah, blah, blah. I feel like this is our country. And we, as the people of the United States, will take care of our country and do what's best for our country to make sure our future, our kids' future, their kids' future is better than what the world is today. That is what we are supposed to be doing. But when you have Barack Obama and then the Pope, basically what I feel what they're trying to do are, to, are, are wrong. Um, a lot of people are calling them both devils and, you know, the Pope, the devil's sidekick and stuff. Well, it's your opinion. I understand they want better for our country, but I have to disagree with the Pope and Obama. Leaving the borders open will not make our United States of America better. Yeah, there are people out there that want a better life, and in order for them to get that, is I don't want suicide bombers, you know, trying to say, hey, we're going to come through your country. We want to live in the United States because we want to better ourselves, but yet they're going to attack us on American soil. And if that's the case, then, oh, heck, we'll break loose. With everything I just said, I probably sound really stupid. Y'all probably disagree with me. I really don't care. This is me voicing my opinion and how I feel. You guys have that right. But if you're going to voice it, be nice about it to me. Because I'm not going to put up with rudeness, cursing, disrespectful, anything like that. Why are you playing with my crochet hooks? I got my crochet hooks in the plastic container and he's playing with it. Thank you. See? I know. So, I feel like there should be a process for people who want to come to our country to make their future and their lives better. There should be a process. But in the end, it's one of I just best for our country. Okay? Too many people have joined the military, whether it's Army, Navy, you know, Air Force. Too many people have lost their lives fighting for our country and our freedom and to better it and, and basically protect it. I mean, I, I'm thankful for what I have right now. I am happy that they are doing what they think is best and I probably sound again stupid I don't care I'm just speaking my mind I'm allowed to I just um honestly feel people should not be crossing the border unless they've been checked up on and had a history check um on them saying they're okay they're not gonna attack us they're not gonna blow us up, they're not going to bomb us or anything, you know, and if they can do that, and they're good to us, they actually prove that they want a better life for themselves and their families, let them stay, but it is a little crowded here in the United States, and it's hard enough to find jobs, um, for people, you know, to 
work and provide better for their families. This is how I feel. You know? Y'all may think I'm crazy, I'm stupid, um, and I need to learn more about the government and this and that. Um, when it comes to protecting what I believe in or our country, are you getting tired? Mm -hmm. Okay. See, this is what I want to protect my kids. I don't want anybody bad coming over to our country and destroying it. <laughs> And if you do voice your opinion, be nice about it. No cussing, no being mean. No, I don't want slobber on my phone. Alright, say bye bye. Say bye bye. Oh. Oh my god. It's been a busy day. Um. So, um, I figured I'd end the videos. Say hi! 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 hi. Friggin' in the in the little bit of yeah. I figured, oh! That's how we should end the video. Oh! I pumped. Cause it's freaking close to the weekend. Yeah. So, and I think Ohio State plays Saturday. Two days. So, alright. Oh. Like the video or subscribe to my channel. Share it to people. Whatever. Comment. I don't care. I'm just in a goofy mood. I'm in those itches. So, with my O shirt on it. Okay, so... Everybody have a wonderful week, and God bless, and bye! Or I should say, ta-ta!